Hello children, how are you all? So, I am Ms. Mudita Tiwari welcomes you all on your next class of Marigold. So, here is our next chapter. Can you guess it? What's the name of the chapter? Yes, the name of the chapter is Trains. So, let's study about trains. It's a poem. So, let's start it. Before that, we have few new words. Let's get into that. Passenger. What are passengers? Passengers are the people who are traveling in public vehicle. Public vehicle means public bus, public taxis, autos, rickshaws, trains. These are your public vehicles, right? So, passenger is the person who is traveling in public vehicle. Next is precious. Precious means of great value. Means the worth. The cost is, the cost is very high of that object. Next is dusk. Dusk is what? Dusk is the evening time. Evening time is also known as dusk. Next is dawn. Dawn is the first appearance of the light in the sky before the sunrise. Sunrise Before the sunrise, whatever light we are getting in the sky, that is your the time of dawn. And the last one is fright. Cars. Freight cars are the trains who carry loads. You might have seen them, right? So, let's get into the chapter now. We have trains. Over the mountains, over the plains, over the rivers, here come the trains. Okay, so trains move from over the mountains, over the plains, over the rivers, here come the trains, right? Okay, they carry passengers, they carry mails, okay, they carry your precious loads, right? So, what's there in the poem? Carrying passengers, carrying mail, bringing their precious loads without any fail. Okay, children, so uh, in the train you might have seen passengers, people traveling, right? They carry a lot of mails, mails, you know, the letters which we want to send to our close ones, they are males. Bringing their precious loads in without fail. The luggage which the passengers are carrying, they all bought them without any failure. Okay, thousands of freight cars all rushing on through day and darkness. So there are thousands of freight cars. Freight cars means... The trains which carry load. Load means all the luggage, all the items, all the items which somebody wants to carry from one place to another. That is load. All rushing on through day and darkness, through dusk and dawn. Okay, so there are thousands of freight cars. The poet is saying that there are thousands of freight cars moving from day and night, dusk and dawn, from evening till from morning till evening, and still, what happened? Without any failures, they are doing so. And again, it's saying over the mountain, over the over the plains, over the rivers. Here come the train. So trains travel through mountains, through plains above the river and the only thing which can travel all the distances is the train right so children that was the explanation of your today's chapter trains okay so we'll meet again in the next class till then bye bye